All right, just in case you didn't know it, this is that time of year which is a really big deal for the toy mm -hmm. companies because this is when they unveil the toys that will be on the shelves in the coming months, and you know what's coming up at the end of the year. Yes, and to be a cool parent, you need to know what's in. Jennifer Lynch is joining us. She's a toy trend specialist with the Toy Association. Thank you for being here. This is important so stuff. Excited. Yeah, um, with Toy Fair canceled, you guys are getting an exclusive sneak peek at some of these products. All, All right. right, well, let's get to it. Jennifer, um, a great white shark. Yes, this is the Mega Chomp RC. Um, what's awesome about it is he's kind of got this body that makes him look half submerged in water. So when he crawls across the surface, any surface you put it on is going to look like it's um, uh, shark, shark infested waters and it's going to chomp down on things really engaging for kids. It's launching this fall, so it's going to be a hot holiday item. All right, now to uh, traveling with the Disney Princess in style. Yes, this is the Disney Princess Style Collection um, Travel Global um, Collection uh, suitcase. What's perfect about it is it opens up to reveal all these fun That's accessories so inside. Cool. Um, it's even got a little um, faux charging cable yeah. um, and a headset that goes along with it. What's also fun is it cool. comes with its own little tablet, and I'm dropping Whoops. everything. Oh my gosh, everything I is going down this right now this morning. <laughs> This but is super great. fun. And a little sleep mask. Yes, yeah, sleep mask, stickers so kids can also customize the outside of the suitcase. Mm -hmm. Really fun and engaging. And then this bear is, yes. what's special about the bear? So it looks like an average teddy bear from the outside, but it's actually, if you feel it, it's actually made entirely of paper um, oh, fur. Cool. And its paws um, feature um, a pineapple leather, and the inside is made entirely of wool um, wood. So it's totally sustainably made. The whole line is called Teddies for Tomorrow, and they all are made from sustainably um, uh, resourced materials. So are they supposed to be loving on them, or is this more of like a something It can be collector, but it's designed for um, ages zero and up, so I kind of think think of this because it uh, does come at a higher price point. Yeah. It's being really good for a first bear that you introduce, and it's a sustainably um, sourced. So yeah. you're kind of introducing that messaging early to a oh, child. That's nice, yes. And he's tough enough to fall off our table and survive. Exactly. <laughs> there you go. All right. Uh, next up, you have a doodling game. This is Doodle Jams, and I don't know if you want to sample this right here, but you can pull out the stylus and you can move it around. Okay. Um, what's great about it is, though, these come with these little um, pieces inside. It's vacuum oh, sealed, fun. so it's kind of like um, an innovative way to doodle, but doodle on the go. Um, it comes with either a gel surface. Um, you can even um, print out and insert your own images inside, oh. and then um, kind of doodle on top of them. A little, little upgrade on Etch a Sketch. Yeah, 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 or even Wooly Willy if you remember that one. <laughs> I've never heard of that one. I know this one that got my attention when I first came out. Yeah. It looks like a breakfast. Yes, this is the Dino, um, the Robo Alive Di uh, Dino Fossil Find set um, from Zero. What's fun about it? It's kids love slime. They love compounds. Mm -hmm. This comes with three inside that you're going to excavate. You're going to use your little excavator tool to dig through. You're going to crack it open. You're going to get out all the different dino pieces inside to then construct your own dinosaur. There's four um, four different dinos that you can then build. So there's a T Rex. There's there's a Tyrannosaurus, there's a Stegosaurus, there's an Ankylosaurus, so lots of fun, and they also kind of come alive with different interactive features. We walked out here, I thought there was a broken egg yolk. <laughs> okay. Exactly, broken. It's melting in the sun. It's a little hot out here. All right, what do we got here at the end? <laughs> yeah, so this is the Little Alive's Chameleon. Um, this is super fun, super cute. Um, it actually changes colors um, to show off her mood um, when you turn it on, but the really interactive feature is then when she enters party mode and you um, activate music um, with her, she's going to change colors to the music and also if she gets really excited she's even going to sing along with you. So wow. really fun, engaging for kids um, and also great for on the go because it does kind of stick, stick to multiple surfaces too. Just real perfect. quick before we go, how, what becomes popular? Like how, how does something become popular? You know there's different themes that we track throughout mm -hmm. the year so travel's really big right now. Oh, We're right. seeing different travel themes so that travel suitcases really mm -hmm. taps into that. Also this is really great. I stuck a bunch in my suitcase on the way here. Yeah. So um, really great different themes that we kind of track. And obviously it's ultimately what's up to kids and mm -hmm. what they're interested in that you're Yeah, they all put them in a room with the toys and <laughs> see where, watch they where they the gravitate. kids gravitate exactly. to, right? That works set up for yeah, yeah, pretty bit, much. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Uh, well we Thank just you. we just had our own toy fair here. For more information on the hottest toys of 2022, you can go to geniusofplay.org.